Previously on One Life to Live. I met a terrific woman. I thought maybe you'd, uh, you know, like to take her out. I'm kind of surprised you're not involved with anybody right now. I can't stop thinking about Ray and the guy from those photos from her old camera. Stop. Don't say a word. Daddy! Stop. Quit coming. Danny! <laughs> if you were going to blow off this session, why did you even come here at all? I came to... There you are, honey. Mr. Buchanan, how are you? Well, that depends on how your date went with Bo. <laughs> you want the blow-by-blow, blow, or will you be satisfied with the highlights? I just want to know if you made my son forget about that witch he calls a roommate. No, 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 no. The air conditioner's not failing. It failed, okay? I'm baking in here. Well, then get somebody over here to fix it. No, not tomorrow. Today. Now. Just make it happen, all right? Just do it. another night like last night. I'm gonna lose my mind. Uh. Morning. Morning. Sounds like you had, um, had a tough night. Oh, yeah, I've had better. Yeah. You couldn't sleep? No, not at all. It's, uh, the heat. Yeah. Quite intense last night, wasn't it? I was up half the night. Yeah, I know. What? I know. I, uh, you know, I heard you wandering around. And oh, well, so. oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to make noise. I, I had to go get ice cubes. I mean, it was the only thing that worked. Um, so, are they going to come and fix this air conditioner? Because it's hotter than hell in here today. Well, they can't promise anything today. Oh, no. Every air conditioner in Lanterview must have blown up last night, and then we weren't the first to call last night. Uh, so we have to spend another night like we did last night? No. <laughs> no. no. Well, I can fix it. I... You can? Yeah, sure. I mean, I could sure try. I've got a toolbox. I've got the yeah. owner's manual. And major incentive. <laughs> yeah, I got that. Well, can you use an extra pair of hands? Uh, mine, for example. How's it going? I'm fine. I'm just fine for the most part. I... Oh, good. Well, how's the other part going? Well, I, you know, this is this is a, the wrong manual for this unit. They got dead batteries and a flashlight, and I got the wrong screwdriver. Could you hand me a, hand me a Phillips, please? You got a tool named Phillips? No, Phillips. Phillips screwdriver. Oh. You'll know it's got a it's got a cross on the end instead of. Uh, a straight line and flat. Oh, okay. Phillips screwdriver. Phillips. It's got a, a cross, not a straight? Right. Okay, I think I've got it. I got it. Okay. Okay, good. Can you hand it to me now? Uh, yeah. Here. Can what? you get it? I, where are I? Okay, no, you know what? Let me try again. Uh, no, I'm coming around. No, I'm no, no. Come well, around. Listen, I really, I really can be helpful. I know. Where, I, do I come around the back? Is that where you are? It's tight. Watch out. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, I appreciate you making the trip. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, Thank um, you. I, I'm gonna let you get back to work, okay? All right. side of it. Uh -huh. Well, uh, hey, it's good that I'm in here with you. <laughs> because, um, we can take turns screaming for help. Well, the evening got off to kind of an awkward start. When I arrived at Bo's, Miss Medina was there. What? That double-crossing, gold-digging, 
she promised me she'd clear out. I even said I'd swing for dinner at the palace. Oh, so that's where she was going. Going? <laughs> when I got there, she was on her way out. She was all dressed up. I assumed she had a date, which she was happy to let me assume. <laughs> I don't know if that's really clever or just pathetic. Well, she's both. Hell with her. Tell me about the date. Bo was very charming. Yeah? Unbelievably handsome. <laughs> you got and, that right. And awfully well behaved. Oh, shoot. It was a disaster, huh? It was a disappointment. I'm really sorry, Mr. Buchanan. I would have loved it to have gone well, probably even more than you. But he just didn't seem all that interested. Oh, damn Gabrielle. I swear, I think she's put a spell on my boy. Oh, she hasn't done anything I wouldn't have done if I was his roommate. Yeah, well, whatever she's doing, I'll put a stop with it. And what the hell is wrong with my son? Doesn't know the difference between a, a beautiful filly like you and a damn gold digger? Well, apparently not. Because I tell you, he'd be a lot better off with me than with the likes of that Gabrielle Medina. Well, he'll end up alive because of you. You know, that witch tried to kill me. I don't know what she's up to with Bo, but I know damn well it's no good. Claire, do me a favor. Don't give up on Bo. Interfering in Bo's life again? Uh -huh. Boy, we got a lot more work to do. Come on, Asa. Let's go inside here. Bo, that door, I'm serious. It's really stuck. Okay, it's all right. You know, you're, you're much stronger. Maybe you would be able to open it. All right, okay? just let me get away, won't you? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm in the way. No, you're not. Don't move. Um, oh. Uh, huh? No, when we get out of here, uh, the living room won't seem so bad. Oh, well, <laughs> well let's find out. Uh. Okay. Well, you're right. It's really stuck. Good. Well, if it wasn't really stuck, I'd have a little bit of explaining to you, wouldn't I? Yeah. If I hadn't come back for it, who knows how long you might have been trapped in that cross space with your roommate. Yeah, who knows? What on earth were you two doing? Doing? We fixing the uh, air conditioning. Huh. Doesn't seem like you've cooled things off too much. I gotta go. You know I'm late. I gotta change. Gotta go to work. And uh, hey, Claire, again. Thanks. Funny how easy that door was to open from the other side. Oh, yeah, it's very easy to open from the other side. Aren't you going to thank me? What, I didn't thank you? I'm sorry. I, I'm very grateful to you. <laughs> thank you. Yeah, I bet you are. Excuse me? <laughs> Honey, you're certainly not fooling me. I doubt if you're fooling yourself. And if Bo's fooled, well, it won't be for long. Okay, this situation is totally out of control. Gabrielle, you've got to get a hold of it right away. 